I filmed a favorites video. But we're here, we're back, we're gonna do this, okay? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been fit since February since I filmed a favorites video, so I really need to get on it because like, I got a lot of stuff to show y'all. So much stuff that I can't even talk about the makeup stuff in this video. I'm gonna have to make a whole like makeup tutorial. This is mainly gonna be just beauty products, body stuff, and random stuff. I've really been enjoying this app called HQ. If you guys don't know about HQ, it's a trivia game. And then it's like a live game show, so you answer questions, just random trivia questions, and then if you answer all of them correctly, you win a cash prize. Um, each game, there's a different cash prize, so it can be like $5,000, $10,000, but you split that between all the winners. So most times it's like 3,000, 4,000 winners, and then you guys split that cash prize, so you end up getting like $5, $6, or whatever. I won $6 one time, really excited about it. Um, but it's a really fun game, I think it's really exciting, so you guys can download that game and give me some more lives, because the more you use my referral code, the more lives I get. And if you refer other people, you get more lives too, so that you can keep playing the game even if you lose. So that's my app for the month. Moving on to my skincare and body care, things of that nature. Um, as you guys know, I've been wearing braids since June, beginning of June. You guys know every summer I do all natural, which is basically me wearing braids. I don't really do my natural hair. I hate doing hair if you don't know that about me. Now you know, I hate doing my hair, hate, loathe, despise. Like my natural hair, I could care less about my natural hair. I would rather just be bald, to be honest. When I have to do my hair, it's literally like, I dread it. But these products make me feel a little bit better. These products help me to get through. So since I've been wearing braids, I do a lot of deep conditions. I do a lot of maintaining my scalp because my scalp gets very dry. This shampoo though, literally makes my life so much easier. I have not had a single flake since I've been using this product. Like, no flakes at all. Like, nothing has ever cured my dandruff before. This did. This is the Scalp Revival Charcoal and Coconut Oil Micro Exfoliating Shampoo. So it exfoliates your scalp and it's supposed to lift off all of the dead skin cells and stuff and help like invigorate your scalp. This definitely helps. I don't know if it's just this product, but this definitely helps. It looks like this. It's got charcoal, and it smells kind of minty. Love this product, and this is my second time purchasing it. Really, really like this stuff. Really, really good. Um, and I let Cam use some of it, and his barber like DM'd me on Instagram and was like, whatever you used on his hair, tell him to keep using it because he didn't have any flakes. And I'm like, I told you, listen, this product is bomb. Don't play with me. Vicky knows, okay? So shout out to Briogeo, because I love you. Um, another hair product that I really like is the Miel Organics, Miel Organics Brazilian Curly Cocktail Curl Cream with Babassu Oil. And this is actually meant to be used on natural hair to style your natural hair. I personally use this on my braids to make them smell better because it just smells amazing. Um, and since my hair is natural underneath the braids, it does help to moisturize and all of that stuff too. This product smells so good. It smells like a fruity beverage. It just smells really, really good. So I've been using this a lot and I love this product. It just smells amazing. Monique, the owner of Maya Organics, is such a sweetheart. I love her so much and her products are great. So, I mean, you really can't go wrong with supporting this. This is a black owned brand, a black owned woman owned business. You can't, you can't go wrong, right? This is another product that I use on my braids to give them shine and make them not look so dull. This is the Flawless by Gabrielle Union Shine Spray. I've purchased this twice, love this product. I actually use it on my natural hair and on my braids because I just feel like it just gives, you know, just the right amount of shine, but it definitely doesn't give me like an overly oily feeling, which I like, it's very lightweight and it smells really, really good. So you wanna have funky, dusty braids. Um, a multitasking product you can use on your hair or on your body. Um, this is the Shea Moisture Ultra Healing All Over Hydration 100% Raw Shea Butter. My brother actually bought this for his beard. He came to visit me in May and bought this for his beard and was like moisturizing and massaging his beard because he's such a guy. So he left this here after he, when he visited. I have been using this. This is how much I've used. Like, 
use a little bit. A little bit goes a long way. I've had this since May and I've been using this since then. And I, I really haven't even touched the bottom yet. I use this all over my body. I use it on my shoulders to give me some shine. I use it on my legs too to give me a little shine. Um, obviously, if you use shea butter, you know shea butter is bomb. Like, but what I really like about this particular one, it doesn't have like a strong odor, like a strong shea butter scent. Um, and I don't know if it's because it's like raw. I like this one, the smell of it, it's not as strong for whatever reason. But the really, really yellow one, you know, the one you get from the beauty supply store, to me, just doesn't it, it doesn't cut it. I like this much better. Yeah, 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 yeah. So since I've been wearing my skin out a lot and it's nice and tan and luxurious, I definitely like to look more moisturized than normal. So um, another body product that I like to layer on top of my shea butter is the Fresh Sugar Ultra Nourishing Body Oil. I use this at night and I, the top broke off. Cam knocked it over and it fell on the floor and broke the top off. And it smells really good. It's a very moisturizing body oil. I don't even know, I don't know how to describe it, but it smells really, really good. It smells like sugar, it's just, it smells so good. I love that stuff. I just slather it all over my body at night. Fresh has really been doing it for me. This is my first time trying Fresh products and I've really been enjoying a lot of their products. Another one of their products that I've been obsessed with is the Rose Deep Hydration Facial Toner. This is a toner and it's got rose in it, obviously, because you see it floating around in the bottle. But I love this stuff. I've actually been using this a lot lately on my skin and it really, really helps to hydrate which I need a lot of, especially when I'm like about to travel or anything like that. I definitely need the hydration. I'm always dehydrated. I'm always trying to drink enough water, but that definitely helps the toner. So another face product that I've been trying that I really enjoy is the Lancome Advanced Genifique Youth Activating Concentrate. This is what it looks like. Now Lancome, you guys know, is an expensive. <laughs> expensive, okay, it's bushy. You know, I love bougie skincare and I'm gonna, if I'm gonna recommend something, that means that it's good. It's for all skin types. Uh, use it in the morning and at night. I do use it in the morning and at night and I just find that it's really, really helped my skin to look radiant and glowy and smooth. Um, now, my Drunk Elephant products were already doing that and the Good Jeans. I haven't been using the Sunday Riley Good Jeans only because I ran out and I didn't want to spend that money because I do have products like this that I just got, you know, sent to me as PR and I need to try it because why not? So I've been trying this in place of my good jeans and I do notice that it is like making my skin bright and radiant. So I don't think that it it's better or worse. I just think that it's good. But my skin has been looking more radiant than usual, okay? So I do enjoy this. I mean, hey, I don't have on foundation. So I feel like my skin has been doing really well. To not have foundation on, sis, come on. You know this is good. You know this is good. Another skincare product that I've been enjoying is this Super Goop Play Everyday Sunscreen with the Natural Oat Extract. It has SPF 50, it's water and sweat resistant, and it's oil-free face and body lotion. And I've been using this every day as a sunscreen. If you follow me on social media, you saw that I showed you guys I was peeling because I got too tan, I was out in the sun too much, my skin start peeling, got heat rash, all of that. So after I said that, like everybody wanted to send me all the sunscreens, right? So uh, Super Goop sent me a ton of stuff and a lot, I like a lot of their stuff, but this is my favorite. This is their just regular old sunscreen that I use on my face. It dries clear, which is what I really like. And it also doesn't make my eyes burn because sometimes sunscreens can be a little harsh and they can like make your eyes burn. Like, I, like if I put it on my face, it makes my eyes burn. Um, but this one definitely doesn't do that for me. It's very gentle which I like, and it is SPF 50, so it is giving me a lot of sun protection. Another skincare product that I've been loving is the Youth Dose Eye Treatment by Kiehl's. I did make a video with this product, talking about this product, promoting this product, but I actually really do like it. It does help to help um, smooth out the under eye area. I actually didn't put it on today, and I regret that because now I can see my under eye area being kind of sunken in or whatever. But this definitely helps to make the smoothness, to smooth out the under eyes. If you have lines or sunken in this or wrinkles and things like that, this helps to smooth that out. If you guys wanna see more information about this, I have a video on it, so just check that video out. Anytime I make a video about something, y'all, or I talk about it on Instagram or whatever, if I'm promoting it, that doesn't mean that I'm just promoting it just for the money. Like, I've tried the product and I actually like it. Another product that I've tried that I did was sponsored for, but I actually really enjoy, is the Sand and Sky Australian Pink Clay Mask. Um, I have another mask here that I'm going to talk about too, but 
I use this. I was breaking out like all on the side of my face really, really bad. And I use this as a spot treatment every night for like four, three or four nights and it cleared it up. It helped to draw out some of those impurities. Um, if you guys wanna know more about this mask, I just made a video um, talking about this mask at, in a like mask and chill style video. If you guys like that idea to do mask and chills, I can do more of those. Cause I actually really enjoyed it and I think a lot of you guys enjoyed it too. Um, but yeah, I actually really enjoy this mask and I've used it for like the past two weeks I've been using it and I actually really, really like it. It actually works. So I wasn't lying, it actually worked. So I like this mask. Even though my skin is doing better, it actually still breaks out. Like I'm not like cured, you know what I'm saying? If I eat bad or if I have too much oil on my face or whatever may be the case, I don't even know, hormones, whatever. Your girl is gonna break out, okay? Uh, another beauty product and the last beauty product I think that I have to talk about. Yeah, the last one that I have to talk about is tooth tabs. These are the toothy tabs from Lush and these are the Boom toothy tabs. I am obsessed with these. Uh, my mom let me try one when I went to Texas and it's basically activated charcoal and you just pop one in your mouth, chew on it, crush it up and then brush your teeth with it. It helps to whiten your teeth. I feel like personally my teeth are a little bit whiter since I've been using it so I can't say that it doesn't work. I've had this since June and I've used half of these. Of course it's vegan and all of that cause it's lush, but I just, I really think they're cool. I think you should try them out. I feel like they don't taste nasty or anything. I like the way they taste. Um, they say that it has like a Coca-Cola flavor. I don't really taste that, but I feel like they don't taste nasty. Okay, and then the last thing that I wanted to talk about is boobs related. Um, and I mentioned this on my Instagram stories which if you guys don't follow me on Instagram, you should, cause I give all of the secrets on Instagram, okay honey? I give you all the links to all the new stuff that I buy, my shoes, my clothes, random stuff that I feel like sharing. So definitely catch me on Instagram cause I'm always posting stuff on there and updating you guys. If I'm not updating you here, you can definitely figure out what's going on with me on Instagram cause I'm definitely on there, okay? Um, but I recently talked about these um, nipple covers and I'm not gonna like expose myself cause I am wearing them now but I kept my old one. Uh, these are by Nude Wear. This is the little case it comes with. Um, they're from Amazon. I'll be sure to link in the description box, but they look like this. They're called daisies. Uh, and what I really like about these is they are reusable. What I like the most about these is that, one, you can reuse them. They're washable, so you just wash them off and let them dry overnight. But I bought these in the end, the end of June and they lasted me all of July. So I was able to get that much wear out of these. Um, I wore these pretty much every day. In the summertime, I don't wear bras at all. Like I never wear bras. If I wear a bra, it's because I'm going to church. Um, but on a regular hot day, don't wanna put on a bra. Don't feel like it. Especially with tops like this, where you know my back is all out and stuff. I don't wanna have to put on a bra and try to fight with straps and things like that. If you have little boobs like me and you don't wanna wear a bra or if you got big titties and you know you wanna just hide the nip, okay. These are amazing and I really, really love this color because it matches my skin tone. I wore a sheer top with no bra and just these. You couldn't really tell that I didn't have a bra on. Um, so I just feel like these are the best nipple covers for dark skin that I've ever tried. They're $22 so they're a little more pricey but you can wear them multiple times. I feel like that's a really good deal. You're getting your money's worth. Uh, I just, and they have a carrying case. So when you go out of town, I just, they're perfect. I haven't found one thing that I don't like about these. Um, over time, the adhesive does wear off, but I could probably still wear these. They're still pretty tacky, but I bought some new ones because I do want them to stay put when I have on looser tops. But uh, yeah, they're the best nipple covers ever. You guys should definitely try them out um, if you're dark skinned. If you're light skinned too, they have, lighter ones um, for lighter complexed people, but that's probably the only nipple cover I've ever tried that's like the right color for me. I just made your life better, I promise you, I did. So my favorite shoe for the month, which I don't normally do, but I definitely wanna mention these. I'm in love with these boots. Like I'm in love with these boots. If you like Doc Martens, if you like combat boots, you will love these. These are the Jaden, um, and I like these a lot better than the 1460 original boot because the 1460 is way too tight on this upper part right here. Um, these are more roomy and they have a zipper so you don't have to unlace them every time. 
I like these because they're chunkier. Um, and I just, I don't know, they feel more grungy and edgy. My inner emo self, like my middle school self, is in love. So these are like so yesterday and I'm feeling it. If you're like me and you love boots, you should definitely get these for the fall. I've been wearing them in the summertime too, but sis, it's a lot. So that's it. Uh, that's all my favorites for the summer. For the summer? Yeah, for the summer. Uh, I will talk to you guys in my next video. Be sure to stay tuned because I'm gonna do a favorites for makeup, but it's gonna be a tutorial so I can talk all about every makeup product that I like. Um, but that's it. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I'll talk to you guys in my next one, okay?